Hi, it's Matt with PanicExitPro.com, the leading authority on DIY installations of panic exit bars and door entry systems. Damn it. Today we're going to talk about the linear RE2 telephone access system. The telephone portion of this gets tied into an existing landline. You won't need an additional phone line for this system. On that note, however, this should be for a single business or a single residence. It will tie into the existing phone line and ring everything downstream of it. If you have your house or business wired for telephone lines but you don't have the landline set up, it can still utilize the phones in the business through the phone jacks in an intercom type style but it can't make an outbound call then to an additional line. On that note, if you do have an active line that this is tied into, this unit can utilize that active line to make an outbound call to somebody that's programmed into the system so they can talk and let them into the door. This has a number of features that I'm going to tell you about. It has night LED lighting on it from dusk to dawn, it uses a dusk to dawn sensor. It has a call button. When the call button is pressed, it will communicate to somebody inside the office where they can talk to the person at the door and then they can press a button on their phone and release the door lock. It has two built-in relays so it can actually control two different door systems. The relay output time can be timed. This is important because this will be the nucleus of a system. What you'll see on our website is some products are marked with a nucleus symbol, some are not. This can be paired up with any of the locks or any other access control devices that are not marked with that symbol. This way you can utilize those and utilize the timed relay of this to open the door for the length of time that you need it open for. It has a help button. If a guest walks up and they don't know how to enter your business or home and they don't know how to use this, it actually has an automated command when you press the help button that will walk them through what to do. It has a keypad interface. You can program access control keys that someone can press and they can gain access to the door without having to make a phone call. Some optional accessories. It's set up from default to be a surface mount unit. You can buy a trim ring and make this flush mount and build it into the wall. Also, you can buy a color camera that can be placed inside and fed into a closed caption television set inside the building. Also, you can attach an optional antenna to this. The antenna would be if you want to buy remotes that are compatible with this unit and then the remotes will activate this and this will activate your door giving remote controlled access to people inside the office or outside the office that happen to have this remote on them. This is very helpful for people that want to open the door from a desk without having to get up. They can use one of these wireless remotes at their desk and release the door when they know there's a visitor that they don't want to have to have call and open the door through the telephone system. It also has a cutout. This is for a NOx key or other emergency access key. The NOx lock you would actually acquire from the NOx company and this would give fire or police access to your building when you're not there. This also has an alarm system input and output. You can wire in the read sensors from your magnetic lock or from your electric strike to trigger this when your door is open so then it can notify an alarm system or an audible alarm that you wire in using a relay. There are three different ways to program this. One is by using the keypad interface. A second is through a telephone call. Third would be using the built-in software that you can utilize with any computer that has an internet browser. In order to use the internet browser, you would have to create a local dial-up connection, which are instructions on how to use your computer to create a local dial-up connection to this so you can access via your computer. What you'll need with the system is wiring. You'll need telephone wire to tie into your telephone line. And you'll also need wire to use the relays to your access control devices. The telephone line would get wired to this box. This is a bypass module. 
this module makes it so you can utilize this and you can still utilize your telephone line as a normal telephone line. At Panic Exit Pro, you probably noticed that we have just about everything you need to enter or exit your building. From our panic bars, to our keypads, to our proximity car readers, our emergency access control, our wireless touchless devices, and even our simple push buttons. But what you might not have noticed is our expert support. Seven days a week we have people standing by that can help you wire anything together, install anything on your doors, or troubleshoot applications that you might not know what to buy and how to buy it for your application. We're here to help. Give us a call and we'll be happy to do so.